Welcome back, Flops and Non Flops, to Legend of Dragoon. We are starting back up with this. It's been a minute for myself on being able to get to play this awesome game. Uh, I'm happy to finally get to play it again uh, because obviously uh, the computer issues didn't allow me to record for pretty much two weeks. And we left off on a fun part, so I. I was really bummed about not getting to play it, because obviously, if I can't record it, then I uh, can't give it to you guys to load, I guess. Uh, let's do this real quick. I forget when you uh, load up the digital edition, it starts with uh, disc one automatically inserted. So, let's give that a second to recognize. Fun, fun. So, hope, as always, hope you guys are having a wonderful time out there and enjoying everything and staying busy and having lots of fun. It's very well possible that you might have a rough day and just need a little bit of time to relax. And hopefully that's why you're here, just to unwind, watch some stupidity unfold, and enjoy some things. So when you immediately enter this area, you get fucking ambushed by the arrows. And if you come in here and click on this little icon, uh, it'll stop those little machines from attacking you. And now I just realized uh, one thing that I want to do before I get too into this. I will need to pull up my trusty little uh, star piece guide. Or Stardust Guide. So, let's see. Uh, let's see. We are in Home of the Gigantos here. Alright, so that's not until later on. So, we're good with that. Forgive me for that brief interruption there. So, uh, let's continue through this uh, so this area is pretty short altogether and confronting the uh, Gearge gang and getting your dragon spirit back uh, but as far as anything else nothing really too fancy or special you have to do we should play with them a little bit more I don't want to stomp them until they uh, hate being alive. Ah. So essentially here you just got to uh, make try to make it to the door, which is not too hard. And when you try to, uh, they just keep pelting you with arrows for a minute. I forget if I have to leave the area and come back, or if I just have to survive for a second or two. If, okay, so yeah, you try to leave the area and they ambush you. So it's just a... survive for a few minutes. Yo, brother, take care of them, will ya? All hail. Yeah, I got them. It's been a while. I'm aching to get them. Let us meet with your boss. We have to talk. There will be no talking. You've already ruined our territory. That post must be from the ropes. What? How do you know about that? That's my question. How did you find out about the ropes? Hmm. Who cares if you really want to learn about Tussle? Yeah, something tells me uh, you shouldn't insult the master of the style you're using. That's just asking to get a, a can of wolf ass. Yeah, 
take out the fodder. I kind of forget uh, what I was leaving off to do on this. Uh, what was I leaving off to try? Guess I was just leveling up stuff. So. Nothing really to do. Not that I can think of anyway. There's probably something that I need to do, but am forgetting because it's been too long. Which sucks, because I don't want to forget that. Crash down! Hadouken! Ouch. Kicking me for a lot of damage. Obviously, these people aren't too much of a uh, challenge. They're weak. They die pretty quickly. Case in point. Run! The rogue school of martial arts is a tradition found only in my village. All the people who use the rogue style from outside of my village must have a connection there. Do you know a woman fighter called Claire? I, I don't know any such woman. I learned it from my boss, Kirch. My boss used to study it seriously, but he was kicked out 20 years ago. Then he became a bandit. Kicked out. Now I know. That Gurch. He must uh, be the man who once was my disciple. He's over there, right? Yeah, well, you can't defeat my boss. My boss is ten times as strong as me. It's my fist that decides I can defeat him or not. What are you doing? I'll show you the real world school is like. Wow. Time to go Kama, uh, Kamehameha on this bitch. Seems obvious there are bandits hiding. Let's start looking here. What's wrong? I think I did too much. My back hurts. Don't worry, I'll be right there if I rest a little. Min, you should have thought about your age. Go ahead, I'll take care of you. You know what I can think? I can wait here by myself. No way. We don't know when they'll come back. We gotta leave them then. We'll be back if something happens. They come back, I'll destroy them. Be good, Hashem. Ooh. 
whap. Sorry about that. He wants to take care of his own problems. He ain't having it. Bum, 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 bum. Maru. What happened? Ouch, uh, something bumped into me and... Oh boy, where's Hasho? Did he go by himself? Get healed up real quick. Required Angel's Prayer. Ah, nice free reviver item, so can't really complain. And I'm not really worried about losing, so I'm not going to worry about saving. It's already been too early in the uh, run, so I highly doubt uh, I'll go down to the boss, but we'll see. If I do, then whoops. If I don't, then cool. Yeah, I can't stop laughing, boss. I came all the way right here. I guess that pebble I took was super important. There are too many people who don't care about their lives. The snot nose from uh, Denounsu. Let's just kill that kid. I don't care that he's the son of the mayor. I got that woman with us now. Now is a good chance, because the woman is in control of the palace. It'll be a piece of cake to take over this country. My fist doesn't desire that kind of thing. I just want to live free. If she wants the power, I'll give it to her. Boss, you gonna be taking advantage of being a wimp like that? Gearch, you haven't changed a bit. Who are you? Shut up, small fry. What did you say? Boss, is something wrong? M master Master of the Rogue School? Head of the Bandits? How low have you fallen? I was right to kick you out. Yes, you were right. Thanks to you, I attained freedom. I'm not the person you remembered. Martial arts is your heart. When you hit your fist, aches. And your heart aches. Except it seems your heart has forgotten the ache. Shut up. I'll shut you up. Rawr. I haven't kept you waiting. It's not fair leaving me like that. You. Yeah, that's acceptable. Mappy, go. And why don't you remind me of your so-called aching heart? Dun 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 We'll take out Mappy first, because he can do some uh, executions, which is not fun. Whoops. And I don't want him to pull those off. Mappy, go! And plus, it gets rid of that combo attack. Yes. Why do I keep missing that? Oh, well. Let's go ahead and transform. Get some magic out of the way.
Lethal attack for all. Well, unfortunately, even if it's for all, you don't want to do it because it's just to try to insta kill chance, which gets you nothing. No damage, no insta kill. Not worth it. Whoosh, 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 whoosh. Why don't you stand there so I can punch and kick you easily? Could you imagine if real life combat was like this where you had to wait for your turn to attack and let the enemy try to attack you? How stupid things you get. Things would be weird. There's some nice damage. This fight should level me up enough that uh, I get a good amount of XP from it. Well, gotta attack uh, the person that's not invisible. Going invisible. Guy's <laughs> fucking tall as fuck, and when Hashel punches him, fucking just goes in straight to the dick shot. Come on, you're not supposed to punch there. Keep it above the belt. That's what I like to see. I'll go ahead and use this. Just to stay healthy. Don't like using items when I can help it, but I'm kind of getting a little too low. And that's what I didn't want to happen. Uh, 
Oh, time to make darts recover. Take out fucking Mappy before he does that again. And Mappy's dead, so now it's just a matter of attacking this guy a million times and getting through. Is there any single fire? Yeah. Let's do this one. Time to mash X like a madman. Stab my sword into your chest. And get punched in the dick. You know, this guy looks like a, a mixture of freaking uh, Solid Snake and uh, Rambo. My name's Plisket. But you can call me Snake. Stop attacking dark. This instant. Bob. God, a punch like that to the nuts would be painful. You would not be that good. And I just noticed where darts frickin' lunges that sword at too. This guy definitely would frickin' just be castrated by the end of this. <sighs> of course he had to go down again. Oh well. Using up items that I don't really care for. So, no harm, no foul. Smash you. Please run, Master. Do, 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 do. It's hopeless. Soul Headband and Diamond Claw. Those are good drops. Will I get the level up for Dark? Yes, I do. Summon for Gods Edition for Hesha. Everyone else gets a level.
do 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 Girich. Now I seem to be helping you remember the ache in your heart with my fist. Will he make it? Barely, at least for now. But if the Giganta over there haven't saved us, he would be completely dead by now. And all of us too. Kongu, why are you here? And why did you save us? It's a strange way to get revenge on us. What's going on in your mind? You enemy no more. Here, holy place of Gigantos. Me survivor. What about the other Gigantos? Human killed us. They stole Giganto's treasure. Human think other species can die. Human selfish creature. That was the reason why you joined the humans war. For and Verdo. Me still small and ran. He saved Congo. He fight against bad people. Congo comes with you, so Congo is here. Emperor Dol say he will make a world where every species is equal. World needs strong leader. Whether you can be leader, Congo will watch to the end. Giganto sadness should not be repeated. There is no such world where equal exists. What we have is killing and being killed. That's it. Wait. I have my own objectives. I'm just continuing my journey towards them. I don't think I make a good leader. You defeated Berdo. Strong, strong power. Stronger than Empodo. Congo wants to see where this power goes. Sounds good, doesn't it? Because more people makes us feel more secure. Besides, I understand how he feels to be attracted to you, Dart. There must be something wrong. Uh, something wherever you go. I still don't know what it is, but I want to be with you and do something. <laughs> don't you guys feel that way? No okay. care. We are friends now. Red. It sounds good. We did it! You have forgotten the most important thing. Come on, you gotta find Lin. The Dragoon Spirit, too. What are you looking for? Maybe down there. You just push the thing up there. Is this it? Yeah. Uh, good. You have come around. I'm glad to receive your fist, Master. <laughs> Shut up. Talking makes you die. Gotta tell you this, or I'll die as a real fool. It's about the Princess Emily in the castle. She's, she's a fake. That woman was switched. Ugh. Don't say anything. The real one is hidden in the castle. I'll catch up to you later. I have two and two men. Me wait here. Bandits may come again. And, uh... Right here is another piece of the Stardust. Lynn, where are you? Meru, are you here to rescue me? Of course. Kate's totally worried about you. Oh no! I'm letting you out now. 
This opens it. If your brawn doesn't work, you should try your brain. Thanks. Do you know these people? These are my pals. We're traveling together for a variety of reasons. You came all this way to such a dangerous place. What great people. Thank you. People's courage hasn't dried up yet. You showed it yourself. But why did you come alone? I had lots of things to say to the gang too. I wanted to solve this by myself. Besides, I thought I might be able to talk the Garrett if he hadn't changed. But something had changed. Probably the person who joined him a half year ago changed Garrett. And that person is now assuming the form of Princess Emily. We need to go back to the castle. Quickly. That's after we find the stolen Dragoon Spear. Any stolen goods should be around here. They were throwing all the stolen items in here. Now let's split up and look for it. Dun. 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 And of course, being the person of all knowing, I can see it just right there. I got it. Wow. Seems to be happy to be with you again. Acquired Red Eye Dragoon Spear. Now let's go back to Pletz and see Princess Lisa and tell her everything. Did you find thing? It seems you found both Len and the Dragon Spirit. Alrighty, now we got some more choices. Still gonna stick with the Rose. I have done a run with Congo in the past before, and while he is very tanky and very strong, if he freaking gets magic attack once, he's pretty much dead. Although I could revamp him with what Rose has on and he'd make a great tank. I don't really want to use him this run because I've just used him too many times in the past. So I'm not gonna. That's the one thing bad about RPGs like this when they give you like six or seven different characters is once you have your team you really don't want to switch off of it. And that's one of the gripes that this game has. Alright. Save. Let's continue on. Yeah, I'm gonna get brutally killed by some pig people. Well, if anything. It's good addition practice. I need to uh, actually uh, switch Hashult over when he uh, levels it up here. Hey, don't you steal that. Bitch, I need that. Give me back my gold. Wow. Yeah, it looks like that one leveled up as well, I think. Might have leveled up during the uh, one boss fight prior. Much powerful. Yeah, fuck. Run away. Pellet. Hundred XP and like no gold. I'm gonna go heal in here and then check my equipment because I forgot to do that after the fight. 
Uh, so first, how are we doing here? Crush Dance is leveling up pretty well. More and more is leveling up pretty well. Uh, Fury Sticks has a lot more to go before I switch over to summon more gods. Or summon four gods. And everything else is pretty normal there. Armed. Diamond Claw has a good more amount of attack. And I think he's the only one that can wear the soul headband. Well, might as well do that. I like the knuckles that stun, but honestly, the stun chance is so low that it's pretty negligible. So, um, I just go for the raw damage, honestly. I think there are some big people here to fight. Yep, these people. Do, 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 do. Time to kill some piggies. Blow their house down. Stinky side. Yeah, fuck. I messed it up. My timing's getting a little bit off because I'm filming this at uh, like four in the morning. And I kind of got up really, really early and been pretty much up all day. So, kind of really tired, but I want to keep going because I love this game. Ooh, new addition, Hardblade. Can't wait to equip that one. I believe that is a very damaging one. Uh, real quick, I'm going to go over in that secondary area. And get that treasure chest just in case it's something that uh, I would like to have or anything I can just sell honestly. I'll probably get attacked. Ooh, bandit's ring. What does that do? I think that's speed. Uh, armed. Increases agility. Yeah, he already has the bandit's ring on. Uh, I think I'll just sell that because I want the physical ring on him so he has more HP. So that'll be sold. And Rose can't equip it, I don't think. At least it doesn't look like she could. No, I also wanted to check. Yeah, I believe that's a damaging one. Huh. Surprising she can't equip it. Maybe she just doesn't like rings. Yeah, we got another battle here. So, pretty much, um,. What we're gonna do here is we're gonna head back to, uh, I believe, the uh, the castle and uh, Flitz, and that's where I will end the episode there, because that will lead into a rather nice breaking point for this action today, and 
and it'll leave lead into a good segment for the next episode so i think that's what i'll definitely do holy shit i just freaking murdered that guy that guy freaking just got decimated See what just a little bit more uh, attack does early on. Yeah, so reason why I want to get back to Flitz as well is because I have to go through all these uh, transition screens. So fortunately, we have to go back through Corrupted Valley, grab the gravity. Of, yeah, Corrupted Valley, the Valley of Corrupted Gravity. Thank you. Can't speak. And that makes it rather difficult to uh, do things. Spin on a rock, spin on a rock. It's honestly harder to get back to the area of the Gigantos than it is to leave from it to here. Just because you yeah, essentially just take all the shortcuts down, but you can't take those to get back up. I kind of really wish after you got through this area that it just kind of let you uh, travel it a little bit faster, but before they thought of things like that, they made you suffer. So that's what you get to do. It's a rock. Eagle. Crash dance. Everyone's charged up. That means I can activate a special anytime I want. If I ever get into, uh, live uh, streams uh, with you guys games like this would be a perfect one because while it is a fun game I feel like uh, a game like this would go so much better with just being able to interact with you guys while watching because uh, not too many people stick around for the whole episode, obviously, that's a given. Uh, but I feel like uh, a lot more people would if it was live. But honestly, I just don't have the schedule to kind of do that. And if I did, I'd be pretty much streaming all day, Monday and all day Tuesday. At least during the evenings, where I think the only people that'd be awake would be people in Europe, so... That is what that is. Spider urchin. Creepy ass thing. Deserves to die. Yeah. Good ability skill. He should use that on Rose. Nope. Look at that single digit damage. Poison needle. I don't want that. I don't need that. Not even that good. Bum, bum. Talk 
to this guy just for some funny dialogue. I am impressed that you not only went over the valley, but also subdued the gang. I forgot, I thought he said, uh, I thought one of them, uh, says something about, uh, something about how they, uh, didn't expect to see you back alive. Maybe I'm just misremembering. Ooh, blue bird. You know what this means, guys. Items. Magic six stone. I could use a sachet. I want to try it this way. Make him stop moving for a few turns. And the... Use speed up on dart. So I think he has the best, like, actual hit rate right now. So we'll see. Nope. Miss. I'll see. Yes. Cannot move. That was two. Alright, yeah, next one I'm just gonna use the sash it. Too good of an opportunity to pass up. Because who doesn't want a three thousand XP? That doesn't translate to a thousand XP like per person. It's just a thousand XP split between the main and then a few, but extra experience will go a long way. I'd rather have a thousand gold, but. I would have to go back to the first disc and start all that farming, and I don't feel like doing that at this time of day. Because that's essentially how that fight goes. You hope your attack hits, and if it doesn't, well, you're more than likely not killing it. Thankfully that one doesn't insta-kill you, like the money one does, but OO oh, oh, parts uh, a different story completely. Enter. Hey, we'll be in uh, Danau soon. Go home uh, quick to her, you handsome man. Kate's word. Dark, I cannot thank you enough, but I have to say it. Thank you. And Don, uh, Danau is saved. It's just the beginning. The mayor must be uh, taking action right now in response to your courage, Lynn. Finally, that mayor has taken action. Thank you for your guidance, Murray. What are you talking about? It's not over yet. What? Dart's journey won't be easy. What you guys uh, do is not normal monsters like uh, Barrage Appears, Dragoons, Gigantes. I thought they only existed in fairy tales. Can't explain it, but I think uh, there will be a lot of things I can help you with. So why don't we go to Flex now? We, cannot, uh, we can't procrastinate like this, right? It'll continue to be like traveling three ring circus. Alright, I'm going. Say hello to Kate. Please come to our wedding. I'm having it tomorrow if it's possible. Bon voyage. And time to head down to Fletz. Mm -hmm. 
that junction right there is pretty much just your reminder in case you forget where you need to go next. Or else you could be wandering around for a good minute. At least the game throws subtle hints here and there. Because could you imagine if you didn't uh, know where you needed to go? That's a terrible character. Uh, B-wing angle. There we go. Take out the scorpion. Because they poison. Mm. I need to use those speed up and pandemonium items a lot more than I do. But it's just so annoying to always use them. Yeah. You know, funnily enough, if you grind in this game for money um, so much, you can be so overpowered for the rest of the game. As I said, I only grind it for the uh, one legend cast, but you can literally make it so your whole team has three items that essentially reduce all income damage to uh, half. So for like 99% of the game, even up to the final boss, everything only does like 5 to 10 damage to you. You're lucky if you even get that much. And one reason I wouldn't do that, because that would make this recording so boring to uh, watch because what would be the point if there's not a chance of me dying horribly and not saving like three hours ago. Alrighty. Let's go ahead and get into this area over here. So, before I head in, I'm gonna go ahead and drop the save here. And this is where we'll end the episode at, because upcoming, we will have a lot to contend with. So, I feel like this is a good place to end it for now. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Hope you guys are enjoying all of the recordings thus far. Hopefully everything sounds and turns out well on every end. So, until next time guys, thanks for watching. Eclipse Wolf is out for today. Bye bye.